Deep beneath Africa, something extraordinary is happening. A massive crack is slowly tearing the continent apart. It stretches for more than 5,000 kilometers. From the Red Sea through Ethiopia, down into Mozambique, scientists call it the East African Rift, a place where the Earth itself is splitting in two for millions of years. Tectonic plates have pushed and pulled each other. But here, in the heart of Africa, the forces are so powerful that they are creating an entirely new ocean. It all started with fire. About 30 million years ago, magma deep under the surface began to rise, cracking the crust of Africa open like an egg. Volcanoes erupted across Ethiopia and Kenya. Lakes formed in the cracks, and slowly, the land began to sink. Even today, the Afar Depression in Ethiopia is one of the only places on Earth where you can actually stand on a new ocean floor before the ocean even exists. But in 2005, something shocking happened. A 60 kilometer long fissure suddenly opened in the desert in just 10 days. Scientists watched the ground split apart as if Africa was tearing itself open. And that's exactly what's happening. The African plate is breaking into two massive parts. The Nubian plate in the west and the Somali plate in the east. They're moving apart at the same rate your fingernails grow, just a few centimeters each year. But in the scale of geology, that's lightning speed. In about 30 to 50 million years, the crack will fill with seawater. The Red Sea will flood southward, and Africa will officially split into two continents, creating a brand new ocean, the size of the Indian Ocean. When the day comes, the map of the world will change forever. And somewhere in the middle of that ocean, where volcanoes rise and continents are born, a new island will appear, a reminder that Earth is still alive and still reshaping itself one crack at a time. History isn't just written by humans, it's written by the planet itself. This is World in Time.